you're learning more tonight about the alleged threat made against an East Texas church. According to law enforcement, 40-year-old Rashid Abdul Aziz was wearing a camouflage helmet, camel pants, tactical vest, and boots when he'd entered a bullet church around 1 o'clock. According to the people at the church, Aziz appeared distressed and said that God had told him to slay infidels. KLTV7's Paul Rivera was at the church today and spoke with the pastor who took us through everything that went on that day. He said people are going to die today. And that's that, and so that's what he said. Yeah, and that's what he said to me. John Johnson III is the pastor of Corinth Missionary Baptist Church in Bullard, which Rashid Aziz visited on Sunday. Johnson says Aziz entered the church through a side door and ended up in the conference room where Johnson and others were. The conversation with Aziz lasted about five minutes. In those five minutes, Aziz reportedly told Pastor Johnson he was representing Allah and God had sanctioned him to kill and slay people. During that conversation, Johnson says that he was able to see that Aziz had a gun. Immediately my mind went to the fact that I knew we had several children and young members that were playing and running in the fellowship hall, and I mouthed to them. I said, this man has a weapon. I need you guys to go. Johnson believed that the only key to getting out alive that day was to calm Aziz down. I believe that his intent when he came to our church was to actually kill somebody. Church deacon T.J. Johnson showed us something that Aziz left behind. This morning when Johnson came to open up, he opened the front door and on the floor he found a note belonging to the man that had visited them yesterday. The note saying, my name is Rashid. You helped me at a time of need. This house is blessed by God and all faiths before continuing. A strikingly peaceful note that Pastor Johnson says does not reflect Aziz's demeanor that day. It was very clear that he was extremely angry when he entered uh, the building and he attempted to escalate, you know, himself. A situation at this church that was brought under control. Now the pastor is thankful that everyone is safe. Paul Rivera, KLTV 7 News. Pastor Johnson tells us that they have never had an issue like this before, but they are now taking extra security.